Spurgeon here with RevZilla to talk to you about the Speedy Venomax H2 Out Jacket available at RevZilla.com. Now, what you're gonna get with the Venomax is this is gonna be your two season hot option with a nice three quarter cut to this. You are gonna have an H2 out liner, which does help you a little bit with seasonality. You can put that in there and when the summer nights begin to cool off, it's gonna block a little bit of the wind, but really what you're getting is a nice H2 out waterproof liner to keep you dry on those summer showers. Now, on my left hand side, I have got High Viz Brian. They finally let me use Anthony's favorite model for one of my videos, and I'm so excited to have him here today. He is 195, 42 inch chest with a 35 inch waist. He stands six foot tall, and his beard is meticulously kept as always. Now, as far as sizing is concerned, we have him in extra large, and you're gonna see it fits him spot on. There should be no surprises here if you are using Speedy's size chart. The extra large starts right at a 41.7 inch chest, and you can see Brian is rocking this perfectly. Now, one note on fitment, the arms are a little bit longer. So even compared to some of the other Speedy jackets that I've worn, where I'm in a little bit more of a tuck position, the arms always kind of pull up in me a little bit. I don't have that problem with the Venomax. So if you do have a slightly longer arm length to you, this jacket should definitely be one to consider. Now sizes are gonna range from a medium up to a 3XL, and there's three different colors available. Brian is going to be wearing the black and gray version. There's also a black and a high-vis version as well. He was begging us to get the high-vis version. We just couldn't score it for him just yet. Now, as far as Speedy is concerned, they are going to be a premium brand out of Italy that we've really seen give a strong push to the US market over the past 12 months. And as far as the fit and finish is concerned, one of the things that I really like about Speedy is that they're second to none. So with the Venomax, what you're getting is a nice two season warm weather option around the $380 price point. You're getting a maximum amount of ventilation with a nice amount of textile in your impact zones to keep you safe in the event of a crash while still keeping you comfortable in the heat of the summer. With that H2 outliner, it's also gonna help to keep you dry. Now for those riders out there that are tackling more of a cold weather option, you love the way this looks, you like the style, Take a look at the multi-winter. The multi-winter is gonna give you all the same look, all the same functionality as the Venomax, but it's gonna be aimed for three season cold weather riding. Now with the Venomax starting at the top and working our way through this, what you're gonna see first and foremost is a massive amount of mesh, but you're also gonna see nice nylon webbing which holds everything together. So this is gonna be a stylistic piece, but it's also gonna be a functional piece. So what you're getting is you're getting extra strength, so you don't have to worry about that mesh kind of ripping apart in the event of an impact. It holds everything together, and it's gonna be that nice 10X 600D nylon that we're seeing as a proprietary material used in almost all of Speedy's jackets. Now you're also notice at the top, starting with the collar, it's gonna have the EST control system. That stands for Ergonomic Safety Tuning. What this allows me to do on High Vis Brian, if he wants a tighter feel, I can pull the little Velcro tab off, I can set it a little bit tighter, and what this acts as is a nice set it and forget it snap. So you have that single snap closure to it, but it allows me to really fine tune the fit of the jacket for the circumference of High Vis Brian's neck. You're also gonna notice that waterproof liner does a really nice job of pushing up taller than the standard collar to make sure that you have no water pushing up underneath the helmet or running down the front, keeping you dry. As you're working your way down on this, again, with the impact zones, you're gonna see it's gonna be that nice 10X 600D nylon to keep you safe, and you are gonna have impact armor in there. It's gonna be the Force Tech CE Level 1 armor that we're seeing Speedy use throughout all of their jackets. As we work our way down, you do have adjusters at the bicep vents. So as Brian begins to hit the gym bulking up, he can go ahead and kind of expand that out, giving a little bit more room, or he can ratchet it down and making sure it fits in nice and tight. And as you get down to the closure on the cuff, it's a simple two snap closure with this. And with Brian, we're gonna go ahead and give it the second snap. So it just kind of fits down without letting that cuff work down past his arm. And remember, this is gonna be a slightly longer cuff to this. Working on the front, mass amounts of that 3D mesh. And you're also gonna notice dual zipper pockets on the front. They're also gonna double as vents. So if you wanna open those up, you are gonna have just even more airflow pushing through. And the left-hand side, asymmetry with that Speedy logo just gives you a little bit of pop of reflectivity on the left-hand side of the chest. As you take a look throughout the front, you are gonna have dual hand warmer pockets on the side and just a little bit of extra coverage at the bottom of the zipper, so you're not gonna have to worry about scratching that tank if you are in more of a full tuck position. Hi, this is Brian. I'm gonna have you turn face sideways, throw the hand up in the rider position. 
Now you are going to see popper reflectivity working down the outside of the bicep. Slight pre-curve to this, nothing too aggressive. Nice overall feel. And again, you can see it's really going to be for that touring rider. If you're in more of that upright position, maybe a little bit of a tuck for that sport touring rider out there. But really a nice, comfortable three-quarter length. You do have Velcro, Velcro adjuster at the waist to fine tune that, and you can see it's going to fit down nicely. There will be a shock cord adjuster at the bottom too, so you can kind of fine tune the fit and make sure there's no water pushing up from the bottom if you are caught in a rainstorm. Hi, Brian. I'm going to have you turn around face backwards for me. Starting at the top, you can see what I was talking about earlier with that rain, the rain liner on the inside really pushes up about an extra inch and a half taller than the standard collar to make sure it works its way up underneath your helmet so there's no water pushing down your back. As you work your way down, you're going to see that nylon webbing really working nicely across the giant mesh paneling on the back of this to keep everything nice and tight in the event of a crash. You have the Speedy logo, giant pop reflectivity working its way across the back. And as you work your way down, there's no connection zippers here, but like I did say, you do have that shock nylon adjuster to really kind of ratchet it down. And there is that nice three-quarter length, so it does a good job of, even if you are more of that sport touring kind of slight tuck to it, it does give you coverage where the pants end and the jacket begins. While there's no back protector included with this, it will accept the Warrior back protector if you want to add that in to give yourself maximized protection. Brian, I'm going to turn around and face the camera for me. And I'm going to have you go ahead and unzip. While he's unzipping, it is that YKK Viz unzip. And as he opens it up, Brian, I'm just going to have you hold that right there, the left side open rather. You can get this nice line. It's going to do a nice job of giving you a destination liner with this. So if you just want to wear this around the campfire to keep the water off of you, if it's still drizzling, you can wear this as a destination piece. It's a nice waterproof liner. Popping this open, you're going to see that Speedy does a really nice job of telling you exactly where the different attachment points go. So this is going to say thermo and rain. So if you want to add the thermo liner to this, there is going to be a thermo liner that's sold separately that you could install with this as well. Napoleon pocket to this. And Brian, I'm going to have you just go ahead and unzip the main waterproof liner. Nice tall collar, keeping the water out, snap closure with that. And you do have a double waterproof gusset covering the outside. And then as he opens it up, you're going to see what Speedy does, it does, they do a really nice job, is they maximize the zipper. So you have the single zipper closure in the front, and then you do have the double coverage just covering that zipper up. And it just does a nice job of making sure no water pushes through the front. Now, my biggest nitpick with this jacket is when you get to the inside, if you're just rocking this with a t-shirt the way that Hive is Brian is, the inside mesh that they used is definitely scratchy against your skin. So keep that in mind. You're probably going to want to wear a full sleeve summer base layer if you're wearing this jacket because there is a little bit of discomfort with that liner on the inside if it's sitting against your bare skin. You can see here there is that attachment point. So if you do want to add that thermal liner to the inside of this, you can add that and add a little bit of seasonality to what the Venomax offers you as just a standalone mesh piece. Brian, you can get and zip up for me. Now he's zipping that up. Keep in mind, with Speedy's lineup, there are a wide variety of different options. They do a really great job of mixing styles and functionality. So when you're looking at the Venomax, what you're getting is that nice, that nice touring jacket, three-quarter length, but it's really going to be aimed at you two-season warm weather riders out there. Now if you want more info, Check out other rider reviews by clicking the icon on your desktop or mobile device to read what other riders are digging from Speedy and that they're already rocking out there on their rides. If you have more questions for us, never hesitate to pick up the phone and give us a call, 877-792-9455, or simply type us out an email, cs at revzilla.com. Thank you for joining us for this look at the Speedy Venomax H2 Out jacket. I'm Spurge. Enjoy the ride.